हेलो टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट मेडिटेशन ध्यान व्हाट इज मेडिटेशन हाउ यू कैन डू मेडिटेशन व्हाई टू डू मेडिटेशन एंड सच क्वेश्चंस विल बी एड्रेस्ड सो लिसन केयरफुली थैंक यू सो मेडिटेशन और ध्यान इज एन आर्ट ऑफ ऑब्जर्विंग वंस ब्रेथ सो वी फॉलो द इनहेलेशन एंड एक्सलेशन विथ क्लोज आइज एंड आवर Uh, fingers crossed and put in the lap and uh, either sit cross legged or uh, on the chair or uh, just sit squat on the have a uh, comfortable position on your uh, on a mat something like that so in uh, reality it appears that this simple process it's a very simple process just we have been breathing all our life and now we are observing our breath with our uh, senses closed but when we start meditating you we find that our mind wanders you will find your mind wandering into the past or the future and it does not allow you to be in the present moment the breath plays the role of an anchor in meditation and makes the mind calm so that is why we follow our breath inhalation and exhalation in meditation it helps to uh, have less and less thoughts so what happens when we meditate the cosmic energy is abundant in nature and it functions as life energy in our bodies we normally receive this energy during sleep when the body and mind are relatively calm and peaceful but the amount of energy is not adequate to meet our body's requirement for growth and healing to receive greater amounts of cosmic energy meditation or dhyan is the way or is the channel and how can we meditate as i said earlier uh, for an individual meditation you can meditate to dhyan anywhere any time it is also called atm any time dhyan so dhyan is done by sitting cross legged on a mat on the floor and keeping the body erect the spinal cord erect people suffering from back or knee problems can sit on a chair and meditate people with severe illness can lie down and meditate in the beginning meditating is in a quiet calm place dimly lit room will be helpful for you uh you can also put a very soft instrumental music around your place that can also help in with some people now once you sit in a comfortable position sukhasan with fingers interlocked feet crossed eyes closed and calmly start observing the natural flow of breath the inhalation and exhalation initially you would find it a little difficult to focus on your breathing as the mind starts wandering often so every time your mind wanders you ignore those thoughts and pay attention or redirect your attention to observing the breath regular meditation would lessen the amount of mind wandering gradually and make your mind calm and peaceful so regular meditation and repeating the this process or keeping the process keeping this practice continuous is the way to go ahead then the mind becomes peaceful and ready to receive the cosmic energy from the universe one is required to meditate at the rate of 1 minute for every year of one's age meaning if i am 40 years old i'll meditate in one sitting for at least 40 minutes in a day however if one is suffering from a chronic illness or facing severe problems and diseases then longer duration of meditation maybe even 4 hours or 6 hours is recommended to 
uh, tied over their problems. For such people, uh, meditation can be done three times a day, morning, afternoon and evening. In addition to meditation, having a deep insight and understanding of spiritual principles is necessary for healing to take place. Understanding the root cause of the illness or the problem with the help of dreams that one can recollect and reading good spiritual books. The spiritual books where you are told that you are the God, like you are responsible, such kind of spiritual books will help to identify and bring about a change in thinking or behavior pattern. So what are the necessary actions? <coughs> Once we realize how meditation improves the quality of our lives, we must prioritize our household chores, meaning finish whatever our daily routines, responsibilities, and maximize the time for meditation, meaning find time, sh schedule the time inside your daily uh, timetable. While we are traveling or at work or in between household work, whenever possible, utilize every opportunity to keep your eyes closed and meditate for at least 10 minutes. As mentioned earlier, this results in achieving a peaceful and calm state of mind. By being attentive and aware, one can experience several things about, their, about your physical body and the soul. In this state, universal life force enters the body and easily cleanses and clears the blockages in the energy pathway so that energy flows freely in the body. So meditation for an hour a day helps us to get plenty of energy to cope up easily with daily activities efficiently. Especially for women or anybody who is feeling tired, regularly feeling tired or waking up in not in a good mood, for them meditating one hour is really recommended and it helps a lot. So there are many methods, there are many methods of uh, meditation like mantras, visualizing, uh, staring at a light glow. However, these methods drain some of our energy to perform these activities or we have to make a mental note or of the count or something. So the serene and peaceful state of mind is not achieved. That's why just observing the inhalation and exhalation is recommended. Uh, the serene and peaceful state of mind results in easy absorption of cosmic energy and brings about healing. By observing the breath, we control our five senses and decrease or eliminate the wandering of mind. The core intention of Dhyan is to gain more energy. We should not indulge in activities like chanting or visualization for which we necessarily spend some energy or focus. Closing our five senses followed by simple observation of breath is the only way of doing correct meditation. People with sickness have to practice meditation extensively to get its effect. Only through meditation the body receives adequate energy. Meditation is a process leading to the absence of thoughts and stillness of mind. Receiving energy is the primary function of energy. So meditation is what? In simple terms, meditation equal to gain of energy. People suffering from insomnia can easily drift into sleep by observing their breath. Having dinner before 7 p.m. and meditating several times throughout the night helps in getting rid of physical problems and mental worries. Especially in old age, when one is not feeling, one does not get sleep at night times, meditate. This will, this will help you in your insomnia at whatever age. 
So why some of the questions we ask or a new person asks is that why should we concentrate on breath? There are many teachers, some of them uh, we will discuss or we will share here. According to Veer Brahmendra Swami Ji, he said the breath itself is that divine luster present in our body. That is how we find bliss by attaining the state of Brahman or higher self through breath awareness. So uh, just to keep on track only on the uh, meditation, we will not go into the Brahman definition, but breath is the way to is the way recommended for even higher bliss or for the uh, the soul journey or for our spiritual growth. We can understand this much. So when we are with the breath, breath energy, the mind bit becomes empty. Now this is important to understand. The mind becomes empty, empty, meaning our thoughts, the rate at which the thoughts were coming in our mind, they decrease. And in certain times or in the for certain seconds also, the we are in that thoughtless state. That allows cosmic energy to flow easily into our physical body. We will, be, we will come to know that we are not just a body, but all pervading soul. We realize that in every being, a soul is present. That is the state of we are all God, Aham Brahmasmi, as mentioned in the Upanishad. Meaning, I am God and so are the other people around us. Another very famous teacher, Lord Buddha, he said, he described this technique that we have told about uh, or described in this video is as Anapana Sati meditation, Dhyan, meaning being with the in-breath, Ana. Ana means Anivai, meaning incoming breath or outgoing breath. Pa, ana, Pan, Sati, Sati means to be with during which we go into thoughtless mind and tremendous amount of cosmic energy inflow will happen. You may have heard of Yoga Chitra Virti Niroda, Patanjali uh, teachers, a very famous line meaning going into thoughtless mind is true union. This happens only by observing normal and natural breath. And no props or no counting is required. You can that's why you can do it anywhere, anytime. Whenever you find time, close your eyes and observe your breath. So, why in to summarize, what is meditation? Why are we practicing meditation? We practice meditation uh, to learn two things or to have two things to obtain cosmic energy or prana shakti. And two, second, to tune ourselves to parallel words or frequencies which are within our domain as stated by uh, many teachers and also Brahma Rishi Patriji. Thus, the cosmic energy entering our body helps in achieving the above. There are many uh, uh, sensations or heat or thirst that you may experience when you practice meditation or you may not reach that thoughtless state very often. But again and again, uh, coming back to your breath helps and that is recommended that just observe all these sensations or experiences and come back and practice uh, the meditation as uh, we have said in this video and keep up the practice. So uh, again, uh, let's say that uh, meditation is gaining energy. What are the other points that we can uh, uh, see or what is the diet recommended uh, when we practice veg uh, dhyan? Vegetarian diet and meditation are vital. So vegetarian as much as daily bathing is uh, necessary for physical cleanliness, meditation is essential for for cleansing the soul. Meditating for hours will clean up the energy pathways and will eradicate the illness without seeking any external help for healing. Uh, 
If we follow our other techniques, it's preferable to do some set of experiments like trial and error so that we can understand well about external health. Then the best impact of breath observation technique in comparison to other methods can be seen. We are bound to know sooner or later that this is the ultimate technique. Now this part is uh, for people who are not uh, uh, who are not uh, uh, practicing meditation at all. Um, you can have uh, go and do other practices also, um, whichever are available in the market or you know about. And then also, you know, for certain days do meditation and see the energy levels in your body. So this is the comparison you may do on your own. In case if you, somebody is critically ill and listening to this, uh, please continue the medication and meditate also for long hours. And later on, uh, we will tell you, uh, we will guide you further uh, that how to gradually uh, you know, uh, do away with the external health. But keep, if you are ill or critically ill, please keep the medication going on while you start your meditation practice. In the early stages of meditation practice, uh, we may feel as if the illness, whatever small illness we have, is getting worse. So please keep the meditation, uh, medication or medicine or whatever therapy, please keep it going on. And for the meditation, it can be understood that the energy pathways are getting cleansed. And one should continue with the medication also and meditation also. Do not fear uh, or do not fear and abandon uh, the meditation practice. In meditation or in real life, if the experiences are related to water, as in a water pot, waste, water tanker, etc., uh, then it symbolizes the abundance in positive energy. So, uh, these are uh, some of the symbols that you may uh, find after you have done, say, 40 days of continuous meditation. Uh, some positive experiences with water or pot full of water or water tanker, like a full water tanker. If we are unable to get over thoughts while focusing on breath, we should never give up me meditation. This is the important point for every new practitioner or even experienced practitioner. Uh, if we have allocated 20 minutes, then even if there are many thoughts, sit for 20 minutes with eyes closed. Uh, we still can accumulate lot of energy by shutting down the five, sentence, uh, the five senses. The thoughtless state, uh, even for a few seconds, has its own importance. So in 20 minutes, if we have been uh, thoughtless for five seconds, mm, that itself is a very good uh, indication. Keep, keep meditating. Dhyan kijiye. Dhanyavad.